Hey folks, I have Xiaomi Smart Band 8 in front of me and in this video I'm going to show you how to set it up. So, as you can see, when you take it out of the box there is really no buttons on the Xiaomi Band so there is no way to press the button and turn it on. The way you turn it on is by plugging the cable so you'll have to charge it and you have these two pins here so just connect them to the cable and then you're going to see something like this don't remove the cable right away wait a little bit just to see the battery level i'm on 71 percent that's enough but if you are below 30 percent i would advise you to leave the cable and charge it to at least 30 percent because if the battery dies during the setup that can actually uh, damage the mi band all right now let's remove the cable and what we see here is just a few options to choose the language. Obviously, I'm going to choose English here. And once you choose the language, you'll see this on the screen. So now we have to install the app. To install the app, go to your app store and search for Me Fitness. This is how the icon looks like. You can see the title, Me Fitness, Show Me Where. Tap on Install. Once the app is installed, tap on open now tap on start check the first check here the second one you don't have to it's up to you and tap on agree now choose your region i live in austria so i'm going to leave that as it is tap on next and here is the app so the next thing we need to do is to connect the device with the phone to do that tap on the device tap on add device and you're going to Transfer via Bluetooth, agree, and then tap on agree again, hello. If your phone fails to find the Mi Band, tap here on add model, and then scroll down to Xiaomi Smart Band 8, and tap here. Tap on sign in. And now you have an option to sign in, you can create account here, or you can sign in via SMS. So I'm going to use that method because it's it's the simplest okay so now that i have registered i am back on this page so i'm going to choose here again xiaomi smart band 8. okay so if you find yourself in a situation where you cannot connect your mi band with your phone the problem is with the region set in the phone because uh, some of these mi bands are set to be connected only to the chinese region not to other regions so this is why you're getting rejected so let me show you how to fix that problem uh, to fix that problem go to the profile then go to the settings and here tap on region look for china here it is and tap on china continue and once you tap on china the app is going to start from the start this is fine and by the way region is not relevant at all this is just for them to know uh, from where are you using the mi band it really it's not that relevant so let's tap on start check the first check as before agree now tap on the devices our device now second time it's not going to work probably neither so what you need to do is simply just to close the app and then open it again. Now when you close and open the app again, go to the devices, tap on plus, and here it is. Tap on it. Now if your pairing fails again, there are a few other things you can do. So the first thing we want to do is to close the app. Then here, go to the reset. Tap on reset and then tap on check. The next you're going to go to the Bluetooth and make sure that your Bluetooth is off. So turn it off, wait a little bit and then turn it on. Now open the app again, tap on the device, choose English here and now tap on a device. Tap on the device when you see it, and then tap on the check here. Yeah, and that's pretty much it. Now we are paired, but we'll have to do a few steps here. 
This video is brought to you by Stanley Quenture H2.0, the ultimate companion for every adventure. Experience the perfect blend of style, durability and functionality with the Stanley Quenture H2.0 Flow State Tumbler. No matter where life takes you, it keeps your drinks just the way you like them. For more information, check out the link in the video description below. I really apologize about all of this. I had to show how to solve these problems because I know many people are going to have problems when it comes to connecting. So I had to show what to do if you find yourself in these situations. And if you don't find yourself in these situations, it's all fine. Then here tap on next, next, done. Now here you have two options. First one is checked. That means that each app installed on this phone is going to send the notifications on the fitness band. Obviously we don't want that. So tap here so we can select from which one we want the notifications Then tap on set. We have to turn on notifications so we need to allow this me fitness app to send the notifications to the mi band so tap on set here is the app so allow it again allow now that this is allowed go back and here you have a list of your apps so you can choose from which apps would you like to get notifications so i'm going to choose whatsapp here got it done this is again something that you definitely want to set. So I would advise you to tap on set here and allow it. Allow it again. Hello. Uh, sync DND. DND stands for don't disturb. So once you set your phone on don't disturb, the phone will automatically set your fitness band on don't disturb. So again, tap here on set. If you get this message, definitely tap on continue. Tap on download. Anytime you get any updates, always install them. All right, and that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment box below. Again, thanks for watching. Have a nice day and see you in the next one. Bye bye.